here is a short video where I will be teaching you how to create a knee rig where you will have IK constraints working with the knee joint. This is very helpful when you want to pose your leg in perspective while still having IK constraint working. Let's create from scratch. I'm gonna create new project. Select the root bone with create tool. I will just create two bones. Select the first one, create IK constraint. I'm gonna select the bone. So the target is being created at the tip of it. Let's create another IK constraint for the bottom bone and set compress and stretch. Now these are the bones that you should bind to your meshes. It can be legs, arms or whatever structure you are building. Because I'm going to duplicate this set now, you can move them a little bit um, to sides so you can easily select them. Let's select this set of bones and create IK constraint. I will select this target that is existing for the other leg. And let's give it a different name. That's it. So I have an IK constraint. You can see a normal IK constraint. And now I need to make sure that this bone follows this uh, joint. For that, I will create transform constraint and click here this bone. You can click match here, set link sliders. Basically, you just need translate, but it's up to you, whatever. And now you should have your structure working, but it's not. Let's select constraint node in the tree and click reset. That's it. So this is our I key. And this is the joint that is not moving now. But if you lower the value here just a bit, you can have your I key and still have this ball moving. 